You have three screws. Now, when you guys are gonna call and say, hey, my screws here is not round, it's okay because it's gonna go in there, it sits here, maybe quarter inch on top. When you use the nut to tie the bottom, this will go in and lock in. So it's perfectly normal. This three goes in here, and then you're gonna have on the bottom, exact way that you see me, okay? You're gonna put the bushing right here. One, two, three bushings, right? You're gonna have the other one on the bottom. You're gonna put it through the screw. You're gonna have this on the bottom and you're gonna have the nuts. Meaning one screw, you're gonna hit here. You're gonna have this. You're gonna have the uh, washer and you're gonna go tie it down. And uh, we're gonna come back and we're gonna show you how you do it. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and put the motor on, as you see. Now, you might wanna do it when it's upside down for people that don't have a lot of experience putting the motor on. Our engineers have, you know, we put, we actually could put this on together in an hour, an hour and a half, without videotaping, obviously. We're stopping and going to show you guys. But if you're at home, this thing is gonna take you easy four hours to do. Just wanna let you know. Be prepared. So you see on the top, you have this space. This is normal, it's okay. A lot of people come and say, hey, my screw doesn't go through the table. This is pretty normal. When you lock this in, when you start this in, and when you start screw it on, this thing will start coming down. Very simple. You don't need to make any holes done there are screws and everything there and actually the wire that you see here are gonna go to the control panel that we're gonna have in the front okay so for this nut you need number 14 so so far we need number 10 number 17 number 19 and this is number 14 you don't need to move anything around. There are pretty holes. Perfect. All right, so this is the control panel. We're gonna put it right to the right hand side. So the, um, the drawer is gonna be to the left. This is gonna be to the right. And it's a very easy setup. Two holes, one in the front, one in the back. Use the same type of holes. We decided to, instead of doing it the other way around, in, we want it to be easy for you to understand it. So we, again, turn the table upside down. We're gonna go ahead and put this, because usually we do it the other way, but just for you guys to be easy, we turn it upside down, we put the um, control panel here, and also ask him to go ahead and put the foot pedal on the top too for you guys to see. Very easy, just two screws that you're gonna go ahead and put in. Same type of screw that you use though. Okay, very good. And there's going to be one in the back. And while we're here in the back, While in the back, you'll see there is a plug here that's for the light, the new tech LED lamp that we provide, the magnetic one free of charge, and then, perfect. And the other two sockets are easy for the, just go in, you don't, One, two, three. And then the other one is for the uh, needle positioning system. And now we're gonna put in the pedal on top, the foot pedal. Mm -hmm. 